Hello everyone, Scott Sullivan Bell coming to you live from the North Shore of Oahu. We're talking about active listening. This is part two in the active listening process. So the next thing you're gonna do, the, okay, so the first thing was head nods. So we got yes and we got no. So somebody says something to you and you're agreeing, you shake your head yes. And if you're agreeing to disagree with them, like they say something like, I don't want that. You're gonna shake your head well, as well, well with them to say no. So the next thing, the second thing is gonna be smiles and frowns. So that person is watching you and as they're talking, if they say something that's good, then you're gonna smile. But you also have to be careful of when you frown at them because it could be like looked at as a scowl. They could pick up on it like, oh my goodness, this guy really doesn't like what I have to say. Or this girl really doesn't like what I have to say. So you gotta watch what happens on your entire face because you got the head nods, right? You got yes, you got no. And then you also have the smiles and a smile is gonna punctuate a good or a positive thing that's happened. So let's say that you've said something cool about your widget or your gizmo and the person's like, that's awesome you're gonna smile, okay? So that's gonna set an anchor. That's gonna set an anchor. But the thing that you don't wanna do is you don't wanna frown throughout the sales process because they're gonna be like, what is wrong with this guy or this girl, okay? So make some notes, leave a comment, question, or story down in the box below about the body language of smiling or frowning, and we will see you in the next module. Oh, wait, send it out to all your friends via StumbleUpon, Facebook, Twitter. Scott Sullivan Bell, only Scott Bell of Sullivan. I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching, aloha.